your brain is constantly making calls about what's right and what's wrong. And though you may not think twice about these everyday moral decisions, the calculations behind them can be pretty complicated, as you're about to see in this next experiment. Imagine you're walking through the park one afternoon when you see someone fall down. Would you lend a hand? We've enlisted the help of an actress and set up a hidden camera experiment to see what strangers will do in this exact scenario. How do you think people will react once our actress hits the pavement? I think she may have hurt herself. That didn't take long. Within seconds, a crowd quickly gathers around, ready and willing to help. We run the experiment over and over, and every time, people responded to help her up in less than 10 seconds. You okay? I'm okay. It seems people will lend a helping hand to someone lying on the ground. It makes you feel good about humanity, right? But is there anything we can do to make passers-by turn a blind eye to the same person? What happens when we change nothing but the way our actress looks? <coughs> Would you help someone up who looks so down and out? How will people react now? <coughs> How long will it take for someone to help? Thirty seconds have gone by, and no one has come close to helping. They just keep walking. More than a minute has passed, and no one has helped. She's been on the ground for 15 minutes. Before you judge any of these people too harshly, ask yourself, what would you do in this situation? It seems people's brains are having a hard time seeing this woman in need. It's as if she were invisible, even to this couple sitting just 10 feet away. Why did so many people stop to help this woman, but not this one? Why does our actress's appearance make such a huge difference? Empathy is an important motivational state for determining whether or not you will help someone in need. But what triggers our sense of empathy for others? Psychologists have long noted that we automatically categorize other people as members of our in-group or out-group. Humans evolved in groups where our individual survival depended on the survival of others. So it makes evolutionary sense to help people in our own groups.